Hello and welcome to this tutorial. My name is Thilo. In this tutorial we will learn how to combine mix modes and mapping of effect layers. We will work with the results of the tutorial using the offset to tile the effect layers. As task we have to add two more effect layers with the following effects. An SCE color change and an SCE water. The SCE color change effect should mask the SCE graph effect. And the SCE water effect should influence the SCE color scroll effect with the mix mode difference. The parameters of the SC water effect are the following. Energy 100, length 60, pitch X5 and pitch Y5. Now let us start. In the first step we want to modify the color of the SC graph effect to white because the color of this effect should be masked with the colors of the SC color change which we still have to add. Therefore we activate the graph effect in the programming view and we open the color table. Now we change the color to white. After we have modified the color we can close the color table. In the next step we want to add the SC color change. Therefore we want to duplicate the SC graph effect layer. We navigate to the SC graph effect layer tab, perform a right click and select duplicate. By the way the map settings of an effect are kept if you use the duplicate option. Now we only have to change the effect. So we navigate to the effect selection button, change the effect to color change and now we activate the mix mode mask. As third task of this tutorial we want to activate an SCE water effect at a new effect layer. Therefore we want to duplicate the color scroll layer also by performing a right click at the color scroll tab and select duplicate in the context menu. Now we will choose the SCE water effect and we have to change some settings. So we change the energy to 100, the length to 60, the pitch X to 5 and also the pitch Y to 5. As last step we have to change the mix mode to difference. That's it for now. Thank you for watching.